guys and welcome back to my channel. We are currently off on our camping getaway, aren't we Lou? He's <laughs> just smiling. <laughs> just so yeah. We're currently off on our camping getaway. It is just about 10 to 10. We left about two hours ago um, and yeah, we are just en route to our campsite with the cat. The cat is packed. And I just thought I'd take you guys with me for the next couple of days, um, see what footage we get, see if me and Lou have a domestic while putting the tent up. Um, <laughs> you can already see that. I'll be saying, put that camera down. What are you saying that? 100%. 100%, but it's just fine because you guys are going to see it. So the plan of action is we are on our way to, like, there's a town before, oh my goodness, there's a town before we get to the campsite and Lou's got an appointment. So when he goes to the appointment, I'm just going to wander around the shops. Going to Primark, get my nails done. Who knows how long you'll be, Lou? So that is what I'm going to do while you're there. And then after that, we're going to pick up a couple of bits and head to the campsite. I haven't got any makeup on right now, but I need to go and put some on. Um, I'm not going to put much on because it's not really much point. But um, yeah, that is what I'm doing, and that is what we're doing. So come with us for our camping get away. looking amazing like the last few times I've been it's not been that good and this time well let me tell you something guys it is looking it's looking amazing this is gonna be horrific I shouldn't even be shopping but I think I actually am gonna buy one of these umbrellas because we're gonna need it today maybe I won't get a big one though I'm like a bit oh my gosh look at this dress I'm literally so loving the neon at the moment we'll get it in a size 8 because Primark sizing is always a bit dodgy I think that's cool actually in fact hey I have a moment here I'm not going clubbing anytime soon should I leave it? I don't know. Maybe the tan on a holiday that would look nice on an evening. How much are we talking? Six pounds. Hmm. No, how you don't like dresses. Don't go for that. Let's get up. I mean, they just did that thing. You know when you sit at a bench? Oh, what's that? This thing. You know when you sit down at the bench and you like reevaluate what you've actually put in your baskets. So I took everything out, made sure I was definitely going to keep the items because I'm sick of taking things home and then be like, now nah, I'm not going to actually, actually like that. So I put everything on the on the tray, carried it all out, and made sure that everything I bought I'm definitely going to keep. And now I'm going to go and pay for it. Um, I'll definitely do a haul though because I got a good couple of bits that I think you guys would like to see too. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go and pay now, and then I'm going to head to the shopping centre. So I'm just in having a look around, to see what I can get. And so quite good Father's Day. Bits, like these gift bags, they're quite cool. And I always think it's good to get things like that in Poundland because if you don't, if you get them in a supermarket, they're gonna be like twice the price. Um, that's cool. It's so good, it's got a full like stationery and birthday section. And I love that gift bag there that says stay sassy. I've got a reason really to buy it, but I think it's cool. That one says eat more cake, love it. I and mean, just for like a pound, you just can't go wrong for these. I just think gift bags really, you end up spending loads of them in supermarkets and there's no need. I'm in the car now and I've put my, you know, camping jacket on. Um, Lou ended up only being at the appointment for like an hour, so I didn't get my nails done, which is a bit annoying because I've lost a nail, but um, I was quite looking like building myself up for like my little shopping for four hours. But anyway, the only positive is we are on the road a bit earlier now, so it's like literally, it's only like 10 to, 10 to 1. And um, yeah, so we're just gonna get some bits from Aldi and get a mcdonald's because i'm flipping hungry and i'm getting hangry because i'm not hungry so we're going to get some food then aldi then head to the campsite we can't get we can't get into the campsite until two o'clock or something they said so i'm not sure how strict they are about that but we'll probably be there for about two ish it's awful weather though like it is freezing cold we went into um tesco's and bought some pillows and an extra duvet because i have a feeling it's going to be super cold so i'm going to need all the vino possible there's a little restaurant on the site that i was thinking maybe we could go there for dinner tonight because then it won't be like we'll be inside if you know what i mean and it'll be warm i don't know that's the plan of action anyway so guys this is the food stop because we are flipping starving um i'm getting chicken select meal so is lou lou how many chicken selects are you going to go for three or five three or five three or five choose your, choose your option three we are in Donach. <laughs> did, did you like my... Um, <laughs> Lee always tells me I don't pronounce Scottish words right. But no, you, 
Yeah, don't, I don't. Garlic. Garlic. You said garlic. I know, but I've got the eye. I've got an eye because I'm from York. I'm the land of the Yorkshire pudding. Right, anyway, we're in Dornock and we are just driving yeah, through the beautiful the yeah. little village. It's such a nice place. I literally, Lou, would, can we move here? Can we move here? I'd move here. You'd move it? Right, we're moving. We're moving to Dornock. Charity shop there. That charity shop is amazing. Loads of really well off people go to it and it's literally got the best things ever in it. Um, here's Dornock Castle. Oh, it's such a nice village. Lee, we're so wandering around this. I love that house. Can we live there? Right, take the first left, Lou, Gordon. Take the first left, because I know where I'm going. Oh my, Gideon, what is going on? On you go, mate. Look at this little bridge. Oh my goodness. Such a cute village. Now on the road to Edinburgh. My favourite view in the world. I'm like, I know it's a bit dramatic, but it genuinely is. When you turn the corner and you can see the sea, and you know you're there in a minute. Oh my god, yay. Love it. We are here, Embo. Hi there. Welcome to our holiday. <laughs> got the reference, got the things. They had me down as hills, not mills. <laughs> they actually had, they actually had me down as hills, not mills, guys. What the heck's going on? So we are here. Look at. <laughs> we are here. Look at that view. Literally, the tent's there. We're gonna start to get it put up, and look at that view out on the tent. Can't even get better than that, can you? Like, what the heck? And with only campus, because the only one brave enough to do it. <laughs> Hey guys, we've got the tent up. It is so cool. We've got a nice cosy in here. So we're just going to cosy down for half an hour, watch some stuff on our phones, and then we are going to... It's raining, so that's why we're enclosed in here. Actually, I don't feel that... Lou, do you feel cold or hot? No. We're both, like, we're so out of breath from, like, well, not out of breath, but we're, like, warmed up from heating that... Not from heating, from pumping this air bed up. But it's up anyway. It's up, and we're just going to chill for half an hour. What time are you on, Lou? Do time check. 10 to 4, I mean, what the heck, like, that's fine. Um, one side of the tent's getting a bit more damp near the other, but I need to pull it out a bit, but it's not the end of the world for now, it's fine. We've just moved everything away from it. We, uh, we had a little snooze in the tent, didn't we, Lou? Yeah. For about an hour, and then we were like, right, we need to get food. So I've just been to Home Bargains, but Lou was just popping in to get something for his nephew, um, because his nephew, niece and nephew actually live near where we're camping, so we're gonna go and pop and see them now. Um, but I resisted, I wasn't gonna get anything at Home Bargains then, because Lou is gonna give me a full hour annually to wander around. Wait. <laughs> the look of confusion. What? He's like, when? But I'm like, do you know what, Lou? You're gonna give me a full, maybe half an hour then, a half an hour. Tonight. No, not today, darling. Tomorrow. Or the next day. Um, to go around that home bag is because it's absolutely amazing. Literally, guys, I'm probably gonna spend £100. Uh, Lou, I've literally spotted out half the things I'm gonna buy already. Like, literally, I was in love with all the items in this shop. So, we're driving to see Lou's niece and nephew now, and then we're gonna get a Chinese takeaway, a Chinese munchie box takeaway, which, may I add, is gonna be amazing. Um, it's got ribs, salt and pepper chips, salt and pepper chicken. Um, it's gonna be so nice and it's raining, so the tent hopefully will not leak. It was actually doing all right, wasn't it? We were in it for like three hours and it was fine. <coughs> so hopefully it is fine. So guys, we're back at the tent. It looks really bright, but actually what time are we on, Lou? 10 to 11. 10, <laughs> it's not 10 to 11, what time is it? 10 to oh. 9. 10 to 9. Um, I'm gonna show you guys our food then, end today's vlog, and we'll continue it tomorrow. Yeah. Look how cozy that looks. Game of Thrones and Chinese takeaway and fortune cookies. What more could you want? So we've had our food now, and I'm literally drinking wine out of a plastic. So you're just slightly in it, okay, V? <laughs> yeah. So I'm drinking, I put my hair up now, but it makes off. Just, just literally. Just literally drinking wine out of a plastic cup. Marvellous. It's absolutely freezing. I suck with rain eyes and my hands have actually gone yellow. But Game of Thrones is on. I'm a loving wine. Just trying to stay cosy. Morning, my lovelies. This is our view this morning. Look at that. 
absolutely chucked it down last night, like literally chucked it down. It was so wet. I'm actually quite glad we've got a dry morning because I'm just getting this to charge my phone up. Um, I'm quite glad it's a dry morning because I'm concerned that our tent looks a bit like damp from the outside, but it, I mean, it survived it. I even saw other people's tents on the pitch and they're literally chucking it, it literally was chucking it down. If you can see, it's kind of damp inside there. It's not leaked in or anything, but even if it dries out a bit before more rain may come today. Jeez, it's fucking freezing though. So I've got this new lamp, this like lamp thing that, a, that uh, my neighbour gave me, Barbara, she is a gem. I'm gonna charge my phone just now while we sit in the tent for a bit, because it's literally eight o'clock in the morning still. But look at that view. You just can't go wrong, can you? Can you go wrong with that view? No, you can't. You definitely cannot. Um, but I just can't believe the rain last night. Yeah, it's really damp at the back here, the tent. Is that not? I don't know. You right in there, Lou? Yeah, now it's like about half past ten. We're just in like a local, they've got like a little bit where you can come and like, there's a little mirror and you can like do your makeup and stuff. So I'm just putting some moisturizer on my face. I'm even put my hand there. Just for, because it's quite dry, yeah. Although it's wet, do you know what I mean? But just get my face moisturized and I'm gonna put a tiny bit of makeup on. And then the next door there's a room where you can wash dishes and stuff. Next door there's a room where you can wash like dishes. And I thought I'm gonna sneak in. I wash my and st straighten like my hair. Not all of it, but just like the front so it's not so frizzy. Wish me luck. <laughs> this is today's outfit. We've got my Holland Cooper jacket on. My big sweatshirt I got from Demi Lux. And some ripped jeans, which I've already got mud on, camping life. And some silver box. I feel quite snazzy today, quite cool looking. Um, if I ever do look cool. I've already got water on the mirror. I'll quickly better get my makeup on before Lou gets done. Nice, I snuck into the washroom. I was like, Two plugs there that I remember in my childhood we used to come camping and me and my sister would be like oh man we just need to go and do the dishes and we literally straighten our hair in that plug and 10 years later when I'm 23 years old I've come back to the same plug and I've just let my straighteners kill down here <laughs> I'm probably not allowed to do that but anyway I've got straight hair so just I can't actually see how well I've done it because I didn't have a mirror, so I just kind of did it freehand, but it seems pretty straight. Um, I just find it hilarious that now I'm walking around, when we go to the town centre, and it like a big camping. <laughs> not complaining, I've got my two hoops in today as well. Back to the car now, and they'll be like, what the heck? Have you so done? we are out in the lovely Adornock, and we've just found a nice little cafe, and we're going to go there and get something to eat, because we're both looking starving, and Lily really wants a coffee, he's getting hungry. the tent out and getting it cozy for tonight um i just walked to the bin to bin some bits but look how cute it looks like literally there's one other person over there we literally at the whole campsite to ourselves that is how hardcore campers we are because no one wants to camp in this weather because it is horrible but here is our little tent around the corner here and let me show you how cozy it is inside look at that we've moved the batches around because it makes much more sense having it that way than the other way because Lou was like falling down the tent last night and I was not okay with that. So it's now evening time and we are at the arcade. That's um, you've got a red light worth double points but I hit the clown. So we're, me and Lou are going to play this and it is on. Right Lou, where's the thing? There it is. Ready? Three, two, one. Lou won one prize for Lexi and um, yeah, I've got to add Lou, he's the nephew here and um, 
no doubt as well. So have a good time. back to the tent and we've literally had the best night ever we had such a good time and um, now we're sat just listening to the waves the rain has stopped finally yes the rain stopped um and it was the most gorgeous sunset i think it's going to be super lovely for the rest of the weekend which is you know typical but do you know what even just to have this this view and it's only like what time are we on? Let's do a time check. It's literally ten o'clock, so I'm just gonna sit here, have a glass of wine in my jacket. I'm gonna put some cozy pajamas on and just have that view. And I'm just so appreciative that it's stopped raining because it's rained from the minute we got here. Literally put the tent up, and the last stage of the tent been up, and it was chucking down. But I'm just so appreciative that it stopped raining. I'm so glad as well because when we were at the co-op earlier on, we got some snacks, and I'm so glad we got snacks because um, I had a glass of wine, obviously, and you know I want some snacks. And I've got about 50% left on my phone charge wise so that'll do me another hour so if i can just sit on my phone scroll through it and just chill out basically that is the skies right now you know it's gonna be an amazing day when the skies are like that oh my gosh so guys we've woken up with this view this morning it's absolutely stunning it is so pretty i'm just gonna quickly put some clothes together and we're gonna pack up the tent but at least we've got a dry morning packing up the tent Bye bye Granny Healands, that is us leaving the holiday park, quite literally, while we go past the recycling point, that's a good camera angle out here. <laughs> but yeah, that is us leaving. We have had a fantastic time, it's typical it's like sunny this morning, but that's all good isn't it Lou? Yes. We've had a really really good time, um, but yeah, we are just heading home now, well we're not. We're going to say bye to Lou's niece and nephew and I'm going to nip into home baggins. I'll set a 25 minute time and dash around like a super woman and then we're going, aren't we Lou? Yep. Um, Lou's going to stay in the car because he'll just distract me if he comes in. <laughs> but yeah, that is us going, bye Granny Healands. And I want to just end the vlog here. So thank you so much for watching our camping vlog. I hope you really enjoyed it. I haven't seen what footage I've got yet because I had to just use one camera charger so I haven't transported any footage yet. But hopefully I got some good footage for this vlog. But yeah, thank you so much for watching guys. Give it a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed this holiday vlog because there's going to be lots more coming up over the summer. Um, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you've just found me and you're like, who is this girl? And I want to see more videos. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.